you're one of those so-called heroes. Thank God it's only you. You know, you should really get yourself a bulletproof vest like me. We all think we're made of steel, but really we're just made of marshmallows. Cat, are you all right? Well, I was just attacked by Green Arrow. I mean, this is all part of that vigilante agenda. And why would he want to hurt you? The last thing they want is an honest aid reporter like me working at the planet and exposing the truth about them. If you're really about the truth, then why'd you lie to me? You seem to be hiding a few secrets of your own. No idea what you're talking about. Why'd you change your name? That's Adam, my son. He's with his grandparents until this all blows over. His dad and I went out for almost two years. I thought I'd find my Prince Charming, but little did I know they don't exist. Just have to be patient. And I thought I'd found somebody who could make me happy. Really? You think you'll get back together? I used to. But now I'm not sure. It's funny, when doing what you think is right for someone, it can feel so wrong. How about you and this guy? Well, Clark, not every guy's as nice as you. I had to get Adam away from him. I'm sorry. Where you are? I changed my name so he couldn't find us. You know, I had so much I was fighting for, trying to change the world. And now I have to hide behind the power of the pen and a new name, making sure nobody knows who's behind the words I'm printing. Kind of like the vigilantes. Must have been scary escaping from him. All I know is I protected my son. You know, the world may never see me as some big hero. But maybe someday my son will. I have to go. Green Arrow and those freaks that tried to blow me up, they know where I am. Just stay here, you'll be safe. I'll be back, I promise. 